Let's see, let's see. Um, yeah, okay, there we go. Hey guys, what's up, it's Wolf, your one and only. Welcome back to the channel. It's been a while since I've done anything face cam related, like a long time. So, you guys remember when I did that last um, Pokemon trading tins? These two. Uh, my store that I work at finally changed out those tins. It, it sold out within seconds, to be honest. Once it was actually changed, people bought them in, on the first day. So I was just sitting here like, dude, I might as well grab a few before it actually sells out again. Um, I grabbed two boosters. The boosters barely ever sell. It's most of the tins. And the tins are like $10. These. This is going to be fun. <laughs> I think I'm going to open the Dragonite one first because I like Salamence a lot better. And I want to save that one for last. Uh, first things first, we're going to open the trading cards first. I think that's going to be fun. <laughs> it's been a while. I've learned from my mistakes of the last video, though. Uh, psh, apparently not grabbing anything to open is a lot easier. It's something I still fail to do. <laughs> because if you haven't opened up Pokemon cards with your freaking tongue dude and just, well with your teeth and your tongue just accidentally like touches it you, you don't know the true terrible tastes of whatever these fucking packs are made out of it's it's absurd <laughs> but yeah let's see what we got out of the pack okay three cards Okay, I'm gonna have to put myself in the middle again. There we go. Oh yeah, I don't have autofocus on anymore. Hold on a second. Okay, so that that should help now. Yeah, there we go. Marwell. Okay, yeah, there we go. Murwell is actually one of my favorite still types. Uh, next, a weird version of Pony. The Pony's here. That's all she has too. A psychic boat. And the last one is a uh, pal pad. All right, next. Next is the um, other pack that I had. Then we'll start getting into the tens and sorting those out. Now, like I've said before in the last video, I still have not caught up with most of the newer Pokemons and like Sword and Shield, which I know this is one of them. I think I do remember his like evolve form, which actually looked pretty dope to me. And then there's another weird champion type Pokemon. Ah, and then I got an energy. That's always nice. <laughs> it's always nice to get an energy card, you know. All right, let's open up the Dragonite 10 first. I'm curious of what I'm going to get in this. I'm actually kind of excited. Kind of. Am I fully excited? No. <laughs> so obviously the tin comes with a uh, comes with the card you see on the front. Actually, it doesn't look half bad. I like it. Hologram. Okay. So how did I get this? Crap off the first time. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> dropping things. Like always. Just me dropping things, like always, dude. Nothing different. Looking forward to see what's in this one. Holy shit. Let <laughs> me grab all these packs. Jesus Christ. Oh, there's another one. Hold on. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten packs to open. 
from the Dragonite. Uh, Celebi is this one. I actually like Celebi. I'm going to open that one last. Lugia. Nice, nice. Oh yeah, I remember, I think we've gotten this one. Darkrai and, and uh, what's it, Umbreon? Pretty sure we got this one last video. No, we got uh, Deoxys and this one. That's that's one of the ones I remember getting. I have to go back and look through those packs. Those will be opened first since I feel like we've gotten those. This is going to go into the I don't really care, pal. You know, I like Garchomp and I like Giratina. So I might go ahead and bless that one into the open last pal. Uh, this one is from um, Sun and Moon. I'm going to put that one in the meh pal. <laughs> and then there are these three who are going into meh pal too. Just trying to ease it over just so it can get darker. Okay, there we go. <laughs> I don't know, dude. My camera just likes it to where it's closer. It just feels like, yeah, we should lower the expose a little bit. <laughs> uh, let's open the Deoxys first. And open this one first. See what we get. Hoping for something good. Hope, hoping. Will I get that? No. Okay. Already. Pikachu. That's how we're going to start this off, apparently. <laughs> we always started off with a Pikachu, brother. <laughs> Why not? Then there is. Hoot Hoot, which I actually like Hoot Hoot. Owls are amazing, okay? Restamp. It's been a long, it's been a, like a long time since I've actually like touched the online trading card game, the battle one, which was actually like a lot of fun. I might get back into that. I'm really thinking about it. I've been enjoying. Well, I used to enjoy that game like a lot. Especially with some of the weird strats pe people came up with. I'm doing this one next. Let's get rid of this uh, card. I forgot what you evolved into. Wasn't it like. Kind of like a sea bass or something like that, like a some type of like bass. Oh, that one actually doesn't look that bad. It's hologram too. Nice. And there's the energy as the last one. You douches. <laughs> Why are you putting energy cards inside the packs? Uh, the next one we're going to go to is the meh pal. Uh, we're gonna do the Raichu one first, since we already have Pikachu, <laughs> so might as well do the Raichu. Pretty much like, why not? I'll say we'll just look over all the cards later, see which ones are like the highest costing ones be the most interesting thing to do at the end of the video since I didn't do it at the other one. Weedle. Okay, I was about to say you're going to focus. Oh, I have a hologram energy. That's, that's the first I've seen of a hologram like energy card. Okay, noted. Then there is a Charmeleon, if the camera ever wants to focus. Thank you. Appreciate that. <laughs> I 
No, I think it. I feel like it'll be better if I just let the chat tell me like what's the highest ones, you know, so look it up myself. Be lazy. That's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> Nah, I'll probably look it up just because I'm curious. Actually, I'm not really all that curious. I just like collecting <laughs> just for fun. Uh, let's see. So that's that's a Pokemon I haven't seen in a while. Nidoran. If it pops up, there you go, buddy. There you go. Next one is, oh, <laughs> Slowbro. Funny enough, Slowpoke is one of my f other favorite Pokemon. Uh, not a huge fan of the Mega Evolution, but you know, hey. Pretty neat. That's going into the Shiny Pal. The cool and shiny pal. And the last one was just a Metal Pod. Use Harden, bro. That's all you need to do is just use Harden. Okay, I'm about to say you're going to focus, bro. Remember when I used to watch like challenge runs of Pokemon? Oh yeah, that one that that came out of was this. I totally just forgot to show it. I was just in the midst of just opening things <laughs> at this point. All right, next. Ah, sweet ASMR for you guys. Just hearing that me open this this pack. Next one is going to be the Piplup and the Blastoid. Get rid of that. So many of those like useless, uh, these like useless cards with no codes on them. Let's see. Nothing spectacular out of this one, I'm pretty sure, Duckling. But yeah, maybe we'll find something else pretty cool. I always like doing these videos just because they're like really interesting. To see if you like get anything like cool, shiny, or full art style type things. Alright, next we are gonna do this one. Silence phone. Nobody asked you. I've learned how to perfectly open those things now. I think I've have I think I have that one actually. I never liked this one just because it's of its evolve form. This evolve form just did not let me like that one. <laughs> and there's a fishing rod. But if you guys do want to see like a Pokemon trading card game, the online version you know a couple of matches and stuff like that do make sure to leave a like and a comment about it shit i might i might actually end up doing it okay throw this over to the side we have an energy which i'm gonna throw over into that pal a coughing I say at least Pokemon didn't change like ah Umbreon. No, Eporeon. That's that's who it was. One of my favorite starters from his generation. Deteria was pretty cool, but nah. I like Piplup a lot better for his evolves. 
But yeah, at least Pokemon didn't turn like super complicated like Yu-Gi-Oh has. Yu-Gi-Oh with the whole fucking white cars and everything. One person taking like a 30 minute turn going through his entire deck just to kill you on turn one or, you know, turn three. That, that shit's turned absurd. Time to do Lugia. See what we get out of it. Like, Yu Gi Oh! aren't so complicated. I don't even want to just. I don't even want to touch it anymore. I don't. I don't even understand what that game has turned into now, dude. It's. It's. It feels bad. Uh, energy card. We only got two out of this one. I think I only hated this Pokemon because of how common it was inside of, inside of Sapphire. Is that a Sapphire, dude? That thing was like so freaking common. All right, now we're getting into the last two packs. My uh, favorite Pokemons. We're gonna do... Let's do the Garchomp and Giratina first. Everybody knows that I like Celebi. Well, most people who've uh, watched my Pokemon related videos. Okay, it, the back of it for some reason did like some weird thing to where it's like really small and hard to grab. So, uh, back to the top. <laughs> All right, get rid of that. And it's lightning leech. No, <laughs> Pretty, pretty weird looking. Uh, you know what? I just realized he kind of has like an un unknown eye. Huh, that's interesting. Nice, nice. And that's the last one. That one was always weird when they first like showed it. Oh, it's hologram actually. I didn't even realize that it's hologram. You go into the hologram, pal. Woohoo. And then we have Celebi as the last one. Celebi, are you going to be hard to open like the other ones? Okay, no. You actually have something I can grip onto in the back. Nice. say please just don't let there be an energy <laughs> umu milk especially when umu milk is like really early in the game we just bought like a whole bunch of it either that or lemonade i think i mostly bought lemonades from like the sapphire versions as soon as i got to that drink machine dude it was over I basically have full restores at the <laughs> at the early start of the game. I actually like this this ant. And then there was this. Oh, he has like a fire background. Wait, those other ones have that? Yeah, they do. I actually wasn't paying attention. Some of them have backgrounds like that. Some of them just have the hologram inside of the picture. Huh. Interesting. So out of all of those, Xing this uh, fire energy, these are only holograms we've gotten from from the um, Dragonite pack. This probably being our most prized one. <laughs> cool, neat. Let's go ahead and Put this over to the side we are currently ready to go to the next one as soon as i clean up all this crap i put everywhere now
All right, come here, Salamence. Let's see what you look like. Nice. I actually really like this one. That Salamence actually looks really freaking nice. Not a huge fan of his, like, Mega Evolution, weirdly enough. <laughs> But you know, he's still pretty neat. <laughs> Alright, let's get this stuff out of here. Okay, pretty much the same thing. Uh, Celebi, Garchomp, and yeah, Celebi, Garchomp, and Giratina, Lugia, put over to the side, same one for Sun and Moon, another Giratina one, ah, oh, Mewtwo and Mew, that's, that's always nice to see, then there's this, Put into the map pal. Another one of these. Uh, this time we got uh, the Venusaur one. And this. Nice. Okay. Let's get started. Uh, let's start up with the Venusaur one. We're going to go backwards now. How are you guys doing? You guys having fun? <laughs> You know what? Comment down below your favorite or most expensive card. Or favorite and most expensive cards. Why not that? Okay. Got another Charmeleon. I think it's just better if I hold it back here and then it just seems to focus a lot better if I do that. Plus, we've already seen these. Ponyta. Next. Time to do this one. Yeah, that'd, that'd be today. I get something like really. Something like really good out of a pack that I just don't like. <laughs> I kind of regret not saving most of my Yu-Gi-Oh cards for like back then. It probably could have been like high value. Who knows? Nah, probably not. Most of them like really common ones from like uh, what was the Yu-Gi-Oh that was like really old? The very like, it, it was like the train one where you're on a train battling for stars and stuff. I cannot remember the name of it. But it was on Game Boy. That's the one I played, and those are the cards I basically had. I'm not sure if those cards actually increased in value or anything, personally, but hey, if they did, that would be amazing. What is in the Blastoid one? The Blastoid one has a trainer super potion. Let's like the brain knees up a little bit more so you guys can like read the skill level. Uh, the next one. Oh, hold up a second. Excuse me. Yo. It's Charizard. Dude, that's that's dope. It looks so nice too. Yeah, that's that's definitely one of my favorite ones so far. No, it even has the Charmander. Now I have the full evolution with it. 
That's dope. That one's definitely going into the good pal. Wait, is this the same one? Hold on a second. I gotta look up something. Is this the same one people have been raving about? Okay, no, this is, this is like a totally different one. Oh, no, this... This is... Holy shit, excuse me? that's the one I think I'm over exaggerating I gotta be over exaggerating I think I'm smoking something real good I think I need to smoke just a little bit more of it oh no that is actually the right one um hold on a second uh, let's go back to the screen display and bring this over here it it is the one I was thinking of I think I Wait, yeah yeah everything's there except for this like little logo but I'm pretty sure that just shows you like where it's from but holy shit <laughs> holy shit yeah damn people are over here selling it for like fucking 400 Jesus Christ bro Jesus <laughs> I didn't think I was going to get something like that today. Okay, then. All right, then, brother. <laughs> Holy shit. Well, okay, dude. I, I just want to open more now. <laughs> those those evolution ones are... They're pretty something. Pretty much something, you know? <laughs> Holy shit. It's actually funny because my coworker actually collects Pokemon cards too. I'm not sure if he has collected anything like over the top. He, he collected like a one that was like $10. That, that I do know. Okay, let's uh, open this one. Dude, I, I, psh, opening these packs, getting this was like, well worth the jolly shit, dude. <laughs> okay, let's see what we get next. Oh, that actually looks pretty fucking nice. Holy crap. Uh, next one. Don't really care about this one too much. Even though muck spelled backwards is come, but you know, <laughs> just just fun facts about Pokemon. <laughs> Even though everybody pretty much knows it, everybody's making fun of like how many things, how many Pokemon's were just random things named backwards. Uh, the next one we're gonna open is another one of these. Oh boy. <laughs> I'm glad I remembered it because I was just thinking thinking to myself, wait a minute, were people flipping out about this fucking card? <laughs> Cause I think um who was it? I think Logic was buying like the first edition one, something like that. Nice. Oh, never seen this one. But no, I have seen this one. This one just looks extremely weird. But he is shiny, so he goes to the shiny pal. This one is the Lugia one. 
let's see what we get out of this um i i've seen a pre-evolved version of this i never saw like the evolved version of it looks so weird that's this one's pretty emo <laughs> feels bad mate oh nice yo is that a full art one i'm pretty sure it is it looks very fucking nice that's that's for sure holy shit kind of want to look up this one because i know full arts are like really wanted for some reason even though i really like full art ones they all look amazing what why was i about to type in verizon am i am i good <laughs> Okay, nah, this one just goes for like one to two dollars. Pretty neat, pretty neat. I like it. That was actually looks very amazing. Okay, next one, which is the last out of the meh pal, which is the Mew and Mew 2. Eh, if only I could get my fucking hands around the tiny little yeah and, and it broke i i can't get my hands behind it some sometimes they make them like big enough to put your hand behind it sometimes they just screw up and just make it troublesome <laughs> I think I already have this one actually. This one. I think I had that one out of the whole uh the Found Mine thing that we had opened. Yeah, we had opened this like far back. So Rot was actually pretty cool. As his evolution though, meh. It was interesting to see him in like the actual Pokemon anime though. You know, the Pokemon anime still doesn't follow the logic of uh of the actual game. <laughs> Pikachu just using Thunderbolt to affect Rock Tights, but you know, hey. Yeah, let's just beat a Stilix with Thunderbolt. Well not Stilix, an Onyx at that. <laughs> Kind of sit here wondering, like, how does that work? As a kid, I was puzzled by that. I actually tried it in the game and it didn't work, and I was just sitting here, like, wait a minute. Huh? <laughs> Alright, Giratina Garchomp. Let's see what we get. Let's see what we get. Uh, first of them is a trainer card. Since so the rarest card is always in the middle, so always move up your uh, back card to the front. I say, will it just? Yeah, there's a lot of text in there. It's not like my hands can stay steady. So just pause it. Fuck you. <laughs> All right, next. And then there, oh, wait, didn't she get an evolution to where her kid just jumps out of her pouch <laughs> and that's it? That's it. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's it. Just jumps out the pouch and just fights with her. All right, now the last Giratina and Garchomp. Let's see what we eat. Uh, maybe I should just buy more of the Salamence ones and just say screw the fucking uh, the Dragonite ones. <laughs> I'm happy I saved that one for last now. Throw this over to the side.
Magneton. Even though it's like Secret of All form looked very strange to me. Hey. Fetchling. Fetchling hologram. And the last one, Celebi. Give me a Celebi card, please. If you give me a Celebi card, I'll be happy. I'll be like overly happy. As if you not understand how much I love Celebi, please. Plus. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Throw this over to the side, put this in the front. It's a fucking energy card. <laughs> Nice, nice, nice. Okay, I was trying to figure out which one this one was. This is the one that evolves into a little mermaid, not the cool samurai one. <laughs> I don't know, that's something I haven't seen in like actually fucking years. Rampardos, right? No, not Rampardos. Where, where am I getting that from? That's the first thing that came to mind. I didn't even read the card just because of the lights glaring off my glasses. Oh. Yeah, that's the one Ash to use. Now I'm trying to figure out who the heck is Rampardos because that just came in my head immediately. Oh, Rampardos. Okay. Yeah, I remember this one. Jesus Christ, that passively came into my head when I saw that. Dude, I gotta lie, Rampardos was actually pretty fucking cool. Zen headbutt. <laughs> Zen headbutt everything to death. But yeah, out of that pack, we've gotten these. The prize and joy being this <laughs> out of that. Definitely my favorite. But then again, Salamance and this also look very amazing to me too. I guess the Char Charizard is amazing just because the price. <laughs> but no, I, I like Charizard. Should have been a Dragon Tite, dude. It's different. Feels bad, mate. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna put this, these inside of sleeves. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. That's pretty much it, dude. Uh, this is all the shiny cards that we've gotten through all of this, dude. Just like, we, we've been through these packs, dude. There are some more shiny ones and stuff like that that I like inside of the older ones too that we've done. Man. Don't regret getting them or opening them at all. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys on the next one. And to then. Peace out. <laughs> oh God, this was fun. I might get some more. Leave a like. I'll, yeah, before I even end off, I don't know what I was just saying. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> before I end off, leave a like if you guys want more of these card pack openings. And I will do more of them, you know? I, I don't shy away from them. With that said, I'll probably upload a, like a Lost Saga video since tomorrow I think is the last day. Tonight, probably tomorrow. Whichever one. Until then, peace out.